What's your type? Um, hot, funny, or not hot. I've talked to sixes. I'm about to say, am I hot or not? Well, we sisters. Sisters? Yes, yeah, sisters. <laughs> really, we sisters? In what way? Like sisters, we braid each other hair. I'm dead. Oh, you think I'm hot? Why would I not think he was hot? Why would I not think that your friend was hot? You want to talk to our mom? <laughs> oh, girl, I would talk to anybody. Where is our You mom? always say you've been on that. I would talk to anybody. Yeah, not, not, not you, not you be delusional. The hopeless romantic society. What's the craziest thing you ever did for love? Um, I broke into this guy's house, um, and left the letters. <laughs> yeah. But, um, it was cute, like, it all worked out, but we only lasted for, like, four months, so... You left letters? Yeah, they like were like love letters. Like there was like one love letter, and then the rest was like a collage of pictures together because he was trying to break up with oh, me, girl. and I was like okay with that, yeah. King Star. But it was cute, like it worked. So. Did he think it was cute? Yeah, I mean he thought it was a little crazy at first, but that's okay. I'm a little crazy. Okay. Well. <laughs> Okay, what's your sign? I'm Cancer. Right, right. Oh, wow. Yeah. Okay, so you be keeping a tough front, low key. You know? Yeah. And then, like, a little bit. Okay. Exactly. You just might break into their house afterwards. Yeah. <laughs> That's real. Are you single? Well, I'm in a situation. How's it going? It's actually going pretty healthy. Better than before, than last year, because last year was horrible. Same person? Same person. Why was it horrible? Because we both had different opinions and different opinions about certain things. Like, like he felt like it was better off him living with his mom instead of just living with me, which is dumb as fuck. Well, you're, 28. I mean, you're 28, but you don't want that nigga to move out of his mama house to come live with you. You want that? No. That would have been terrible. Yeah. Because you would have been getting that nigga mom. Yeah. Yes. Well, I was that nigga mom, okay? Buying what are you houses doing? I was buying you said him, what? I was buying him ounces of packs, what? washing his clothes, putting money, doing everything. What was he doing money. for you? What was he doing was giving me dick. Ain't no time to cry now, sister. No more. Ain't be honest with y'all. It's me. But Dude, at least you're being real. Sometimes dick is enough, right? I, I guess when you know how to do everything for yourself. Well, is it going well now? He on his mama house? Yeah, he still has mama house. Oh, he's but still he's there. He got a job now. Oh, yo, you was talking to me. He had no job. Oh, you be seventeen thirty eight. Stick beside him. So I was doing a whole bit standing beside him. So why did you like this show? Well, we were official, but then we broke up back in November around Thanksgiving time. Why? Because he just felt like, okay, we we living together is just too much. We're arguing a lot, but we were only arguing because I felt like I was putting everything in the house and he wasn't. Well, you he had no job, so he that's like. So the problem is, you let a nigga come I in your house. I just have a hustle. Come on. But you got to understand, I'm not going to say you got to take accountability, but what do you think was going to happen when a nigga with no job going to move in with you? What did you think was going to happen? <laughs> That's no shade to you, but just think about it. <laughs> no, you're right. Have you ever been delusional? No. I know who's hot and who's not. Oh, you think I'm hot? Okay. And I definitely be planning what's my moves which from now. And the next, what, 50 moves? Okay. Because what? That's what a Virgo does. Thank you. What is you see? want? Mm. See, I see a couple of my types in this area. Okay, and? Okay. Energy, your energy towards me. I just like feel like you like. I feel like you hate me. I hate you. Yes. I'm sorry. I try not to talk to. Oh, Armand. Let's <laughs> get over. So, Armand. Yeah. I have you another suitor. What? Yeah, who? What are you talking about? He said you thought you was cute. Oh, hey. <laughs> What's I think both of y'all was cute. So oh, thank not... you. That was never the question. But you said you thought our mom was cuter and that you wanted to like I didn't say cuter. 
I said I thought your friend was cute too. I know. I love. I was say I love the beauty. I love the bindi though. Thank it's you. Very nice touch. Thank you. Okay, if you were to shoot your shout out in our bond, what would you say? Damn. <laughs> Me on the spot. Yeah, that's what Jaha does. It's kind of a bad problem. I'm Stephanie, she, her. Okay, are you single, Stephanie? I am. Why? Uh, well, I actually just moved to New York a month ago from Ohio. Oh, damn, Ohio? Yeah, so I was ready to move here and meet new people. Okay, well, what do you think so far? Anybody here today that you think is a little cute? Everyone. Everyone in New York is cute. Anybody who shoot your shot to? Right now? Yeah, choose someone, I'll help you. <laughs> it's like you have your pick. Uh, what about you? You like girls, boys, theys, thems? Uh, boys. Okay, so we have pride. Um. We need to find you a cute little bisexual. <laughs> okay, it's gonna be kind of hard here, maybe. What about these two? <laughs> this one in the right look bisexual. Yeah, okay, I like the one on the right. Hey, in the pink, come here. Yeah, you. Really quick question. Yeah. Are you bisexual? No. Okay, never mind. <laughs> I ain't trying to be elusive. I'm just asking. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. Never mind. Okay. Um, what about this guy? This old guy? This one? The, you want the old one? <laughs> no. no. Girl, I don't know. I think he's pretty gay. Look. Yeah. That's <laughs> sorry. That don't do that. Don't do that. Okay, well, what's the craziest thing you ever did for love? Uh, one time I had sex in a TJ Maxx um, dressing room. Was, that, was it worth it? Was I fine? Like, did you yeah, get it Yeah, we met in the middle. Because, like, we live five hours away, so we met in the middle. Wait, 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 wait. Be so fucking for real. <laughs> Don't act shocked. And my mom was in the, in the, in it shopping around with my sister. And, like, we went in the dressing room. Because I hadn't seen him in, like, months. <laughs> so your mom was with the bullshit. <laughs> she didn't know. She didn't know? <laughs> Oh, God. No, yeah. Oh, God bless the mama. The hopeless romantic society. My name is Christian, and my pronouns are they and them. Okay, period. Are you single, Christian? <laughs> um, <laughs> yeah. Why? Um, I mean, I'm, I'm with a couple people in the, you know, this is Brooklyn. We practice polyamory. I had a feeling. <laughs> yeah, it's cute, but I mean, my the main guy that I'm with has a girlfriend. Oh. I mean, he, she knows, she knows, she knows about me. Yeah. Talk that to you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know. Oh. No, I'm not, I'm not here wrecking houses. Not anymore, girl. I'm not. You, you have before? Before? Yeah, I'm sorry. Um, okay. It was three, four times. Oh. It's four times. But I learned from those. I learned from those to be better. I learned from those to be so much better. I did. You mad at me? I'm not mad at you, but the comments might. God okay. might be mad at me. See, as you can see, the more you fuck around, the more you're gonna find out. But you know, it's the comment. I like to think of the comments like therapy. Like therapy? What do they know? What do they know? Like they're, you know, sometimes they just drag you to the point like, you know, maybe, maybe they a little right. I have gotten dragged so much. I'm like, sorry, girl. Why are you getting dragged for? Lollygagging. Oh, yeah. I mean, lollygagging. We can't lollygag on the internet. I mean, yeah. you know, people very critical of the black queers out here. <laughs> wake that up, please. Wake that up. Don't want me to say that. Don't want to say that. My bad. They, they do. Bad. That's what I'm saying. Like y'all be dragging us. Like y'all don't be dragging the white people. It's crazy. Oh my god. I'm working. Work that out. <laughs> so. What's the craziest thing you ever did for love? I think in my life together. The craziest thing I ever did for love? Um, I was with a white man when he was three hours away and I was in college and I could have explored and I had people that was like, oh, I want to see you. I want to take you on dates or whatever. And I was like, I have a white man back home. <laughs> I mean, I just say that verbatim. They didn't know all that. But like, did, was he like worth it? Like, was he like putting it down good or like? 
It was. It was. It was going. But y'all was going together. It was, go, it was going. Y'all no, was we going together, together bad. We was going together bad. He lived a far way away, but like you know, we cared about each other. I know. That's it was right. really cute. Um, his new girlfriend is very cute. Um, she's a very beautiful woman. She's gonna be. I love that you're not a hater. Yeah. Look, I know. Look, I love him. We're not in contact because I told him I don't want to be in contact with him anymore. But what's your sign? <laughs> I'm an Aquarius. Oh wow. So what do you think about this slander that Aquarius is? It doesn't matter. Uh, look, I don't give a fuck what y'all say about Aquariuses. I don't give a fuck what y'all say. We are smart. We are intelligent. We are caring. And Delusional. If we don't, and if we don't, okay. And if we have delusions of, of 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 not caring about you, then you know, maybe it wasn't you wasn't putting it down like you thought it was. Clock that tea. Clock I mean, that it's tea. just a little real. It's just a little real. I'm sorry, y'all, but Aquariuses are sweet. Y'all just haven't unlocked that part of it yet. Mm. I don't want to. Oh, you don't want to. What's wrong with Aquarius? What you got? You got to I never us? dated Aquarius, but that's why. Because I just know about y'all. So I just don't. What you know, I feel like, I feel like you're kind of cool. I like your vibe. You couldn't bag an Aquarius. You couldn't bag an Aquarius. Okay, maybe, uh, maybe you're actually kind of like right. that team. Yeah. Okay, look here, Velma. <laughs> Sorry, bro. <laughs> Or oh. shoot your shot at one of us. God damn. I'm about to say, if you think I was hating on you all day, I just thought your energy towards me was a lot. I'm about to say, a lot of energy yeah. is not a bad thing. Girl. It means I'm passionate. Thank you. <laughs> Muffet, Muffet. I'm about to say, last time I checked, you was the make out queen. So don't I get can choose like when cheap. I want to make out when Zara? I don't want to make out. Yeah, Zara. Zara. Zara yeah. I'm about to say, if I was to make out again. with you, would you make out? So what about a kiss on the cheek? Also, it's on cheeks, fine. But don't be sad, huh? Wait, excuse me, excuse me. Hi, excuse me. Sorry. Don't get it. Yeah. It's okay. Here, come on, the sun. Come on. Come around. Come around. Thank you. Now you have access. To the only way I would make a move on you is if I was in the club. Why are you scared? I never really made moves outside. What about a kiss on the cheek? Does it look stupid? Yeah, no, no, no. no. You, you give me a kiss on the cheek or if I give No, you give me a kiss on the cheek. You don't want to want to kiss me. No, 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 no. no. I, 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 would, no you would I have a kiss, yeah. I, I have promised a couple other people a kiss, but I was like, sometimes you can change your mind. Sometimes you go on from lollygagging. Okay, okay. You can always change your mind. That's never the question. Right. So, go ahead. I'm done. Thank you. Not you trying to keep it there. Be the hopeless romantic society. Well, what's a red flag you would ignore in someone that's really fine? Like if they disrespected me. <laughs> so bad. I know the humor is like a good coping mechanism. <laughs> yeah. But baby, did we got therapy? <laughs> yeah, we did. <laughs> okay. You do get Velma a little bit. I know, it's the glasses, it's hey, the glasses. Hey. And I also know everything, so it's a little bit of that. Like, you just look like you got a Jamaican man that don't play about you. <laughs> I do live in Crown Heights. If you don't know, girl, get your little beef patty in Crown Heights. I don't want a little beef cake. <laughs> <laughs> what, what does pride mean to you? What does pride mean to me? Girl, it's about fuck the systems. Like, Period. it's really about fuck the systems, fuck the corporations, fuck the algorithms, fuck the matrix, girl. Pride is anti antithetical to all of that. Like, right. we exist in spite of that. We exist against right. it. Like, that's what we're meant to do. That's what we're meant to be doing. Like, they're actively trying to kill us out here. They're really actively trying to kill Black us out here. It's not cute. Like, all we have to do is live and support each other, and that's even a fucking struggle. So whatever we have to do, whatever we have to burn, whoever we have to, right. it's gonna have to happen. I'm not gay, but I'll definitely let a bitchy. Oh. Okay, was well, there a girl here that you like? Right here. Okay. Which one you want to, the most? Dynasty. Who's that? The light skin Right here. Yeah. The one that be fighting? Yeah. Okay, tell her what you told me. Oh, I oh, said, I said, I'll let them both be. I thought you would, Bookie, but you got. Ooh, I have no problem with that. You see that? What, are you going to too? Yeah, why not? Who's she going to? Just like Thanksgiving. 
<laughs> would that be your first like lesbian experience or no. lesbianism? Please, please. It would be uh, best, yeah. Oh, rock that team. The Hopeless Romantic Society. Welcome to Hopeless Romantic Society. How does it feel to be at the glow party? Um, Because I'm in panic for sewing um, this damn skirt and this corset top, uh -huh. um, it feels good. Okay. I'm a little erratic. So I was going to say, um, I had a rough week, and today I'm on like demon time. Oh, no, that's right. But I'm trying to suppress her. Okay. Just a little bit. She was cute though, so we ain't gonna she be mad at that. She was cute though, so we gonna give her some time. We're not gonna be mad at that. Okay. So if you had a song in mind right now to describe your outfit, what would it be? So it's called Vampiros. Ooh, sing it's it. It's by um, Raul Alejandro Ooh. and his fiance Rosalie. Ooh. And Vampiros is just um, vampires. Oh. You and look so like a vampire? Yeah, I mean. Wait, sing it, sing it. <laughs> I can't. I cannot. It's too. It's too demonic, kind of. My name is Dara. My pronouns are cunt, doll. Okay, period. Are you single? Uh, I'm. I'm single. How single? Okay, you very said like single. it was a question. Hold on. I'm very single. Are you? Oh, are you? I'm very Ooh. single. You're okay. not talking to nobody. Mm, I'm talking to a lot of people. Oh, call me too. That's yeah. A messy bitch. How many would you say? Um, it's like a draft list. This is like I'm at. Uh, this is a work part. This is an office party for Ooh, me. I'm the fashion okay. director of Interview Magazine. Okay. And Come so, through, so you can't uh, tell your uh, teeth too cannot, much. Yeah, I'm not kissing and telling. What's a sign that y'all would not date? A sign I won't date. I don't really know Libra. enough about astrology. Why oh, not a Libra? My ex-boyfriend was a Libra. Why y'all break up? Libra and Gemini. Okay, you can't kiss and tell. It was mutual. It was. It's mad love, and okay. it's okay. You know, Libras come off as nice and loving and shit. The they be cheating. Office. Cheating, dirty dicks, all that. Not dirty. Hopeless romantic society. It's the hopeless romantic society. The hopeless romantic society. It's the hopeless romantic society.